YouTube, what's going on? Streamers Playbook here, and I'm here to make your streams come true. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add a follow age command on your Twitch channel using Streamlabs. Now, you've probably seen this in chats where people go exclamation point follow age and it pops up. You've been following for such and such amount of time. It's a great way to increase engagement. It gets your chat kind of pumped and it's like a badge of honor. Oh, look, I've been following Streamers Playbook for one year, for three months, whatever it may be. I remember when I first put this command in my channel that it popped off and people just kept using it and it was pretty cool. So it's a great way to increase engagement. Like I said, how people show off how long they've been following your channel. Now I use Streamlabs. I think it's an awesome software and we're going to be using the cloud bot. If you need help setting up your cloud bot, I put a link to that a video that I have to help you set that up down in the description. Go ahead and check that out if you need it. Without with any more hesitation, let's go ahead and I'll show you how to add the follow, follow age on Streamlabs. Okay, so here we are on this is, you know, your Streamlabs page. We're going to go over here and open up right here, CloudBot. Go ahead and click on that and it's going to open up a new tab for you. Now, when you're in that new tab, make sure that this up here is enabled. This is your CloudBot. Make sure it's enabled. If not, those commands won't work. Now that it's enabled, you want to go over here to your commands. Go ahead and click commands. You click add command. Now, this is what's awesome about Streamlabs on Nightbot. It's a little trickier to add this command. But here, we just click the template, go down to follow age, and then this, this is what you want the command to be. I li like follow age because that's what everyone knows. It's just common. I wouldn't mess with that. Now this, you can play around with it a little bit. So this is, the way it's set up now is it's gonna say whoever put in the command. So let's say uh, Shark Dog. Shark Dog has been following and then streamers play books, so it's your channel for, and then this is gonna be the time that you've been following. I wouldn't mess with these brackets, anything in between them, because that's like the coding, so it'll, it could mess it up. But you can't play with this stuff outside of it. So if you want to say something has been following this amazing channel for, you know, something like that, you can kind of play around with it right there on the outside of these brackets. But one, once that looks good to you, you want to choose here how you're going to reply to the individual. Personally, I think it's cool to do it with chat. Like I mentioned earlier, it's cool to kind of for them to show off. Hey, I've been following for such and such amount of time. It's pretty cool. I prefer that over a whisper, but again, this is how you would change that. And then this is who can use it. Regulars, subscribers, mods, streamer, whoever. Now, once this looks good, go over here and you want to click to the advanced settings. Now, you could set the cooldowns here. So global cooldown is how long the chat as a whole can use it. So this is in seconds, by the way. So every 10 seconds, someone can use this command. And then this is the individual like cooldown. So I personally don't have those set yet. I'm a smaller streamer, but if you kind of have a bigger channel or your chat's like very talkative, things like that, you might want to mess with some of these cooldowns so you're not just getting spammed with follow age commands, all right? This is how much you want these commands to cost. You can play around with those. And then the other important thing here is an alias. So what the alias is, is if someone does, you know, exclamation point follow age, the command, it'll activate, right? But alias lets you put another name. So let you want to do exclamation point channel follow or something else, you can do that. So if they put exclamation point channel follows or follow age, it won't matter, it'll do the same thing. That's what the alias is. It's just another command for the same thing. So, or another name for the same command, my bad. That's how you'd mess around with that. Well, if it all looks good here, you go ahead and look it over. You're like, hey, it looks good. Go ahead and click confirm. I'm going to click close, I already have it. And it should appear here on the bottom. And now we're going to go over back to Streamlabs just to test it out. So if someone types in your chat, exclamation point, follow, age, the command boom pops up. It's been following for nine months and three weeks, right? So it's pretty cool. It's awesome, like I said, to increase engagement. I use it on my channel. I think it's great. If this video was helpful, go ahead and click the like button. And if you're into streaming, I promise I have something that could help you. I'm coming out with streaming tips. Monday through Friday to help you all with your streams. Hit the sub if you want more info. If not, I'll see you in the next one, hopefully. But thanks for being here. Peace.